Hey BFFs, in this video I'm going to show you how to deliver a file using MailChimp. So you know that I teach everybody how to build their mailing list by delivering a freebie. It's not a concept new to me, but I teach you the tech um, behind how to do it. So here is exactly how you can deliver your freebie from within MailChimp completely. You don't even need to have a website to do this. So first you're going to log into MailChimp. If you don't already have an account, you'll create one. The one little caveat for this to work is that you have to have a paid MailChimp account. I am working on a client's um, MailChimp account right now, so we'll just pop over into her account and make sure that she's got the monthly plan set up. We could also um check out her plan and she could change to pay as you go if you if she wanted to so she could buy 300 credits for nine bucks but she's doing the ten dollar a month um plan to get the mailchimp automation which is totally perfect for what we need so she's already gone through all of the steps to create her automation workflow but i'll just walk you through those really quickly so you can see that so what that means is that when someone subscribes to our list, MailChimp's going to automatically send them a series of emails. So we're going to select her list and then we are just going to do, we're going to send a welcome message. And in this welcome message, we're going to deliver our freebie. So now that we selected that, we fill out all of the, um, all of the required fields. I'm just going to call this MailChimp test so that she knows um, all of the other fields. We're not gonna go through these. I go into those more in my MailChimp's, MailChimp Tips, Tricks, and Hacks Masterclass, um, which I'll give you more information about. We wanna trigger this workflow when people subscribe to her list, so that step's fine. And now we're gonna add an email to this workflow, and, we'll just, and we wanna change the delay to happen immediately. So we want this email to send immediately after someone subscribes to our list and then we'll go in and design our email. Now at this point I'm going to go back to the email that she already has set up so that I can show you how we um, change out that um, or how we actually add our freebie to it. So Angie sends out this business rescue checklist so I'm gonna pause and edit this email and then I'm going to click right there on the title to edit it and we're just gonna oops let me go back here I'm gonna click on design right down here because I want to edit the content of this email and so she sends out a set of three to-do list printables to get you organized in 2016 and she's dragged a button over to her um, over to her excuse me her email so that when you click on the button the PDF downloads so she, we, she changed it to get it now she linked it to a file that's the trick here instead of linking it to a web address she linked it to a file so we click on file and we're gonna upload, by clicking over here, her freebie PDF that she created. And so now, when you click on this Get It Now button, it's going to download her PDF. So let's look at the advanced options. We want it to open in a new window. Awesome, so I'm gonna delete the old button that linked to the old PDF. And I'm gonna save and close this. So what happens now is when someone subscribes to Angie's email list, they and they confirm their subscription, this email is gonna be sent to them, and when they click on the Get It Now button, they're gonna download that PDF. So as you can see, we don't even need a website to deliver this freebie. A lot of people think that they need to upload a file to their website somehow, MailChimp can do all of it for you. Your website's where you go to have people opt in, but um, I'm gonna show you in another little tutorial video how you can even connect MailChimp to your Facebook page. So if your website is still 
in process, you can still start um, bringing people to your site. So the next step is just to click through all of these options, whoops, and then we want to um, resume sending this email. So we're going to click on the drop down and we're going to click resume. And so now this email will be sent out to any of the subscribers that were waiting in the queue. And we also want to go through one more step and send us, a, send ourselves a test email. And we'll see how that worked. <clears throat> and so let's go to my airmail and my inbox. <clears throat> And there it is and let's see if I got my three pack of printables and there it is so that's all set that's how you add your freebie to your email to deliver it to the people that signed up for your project for more tutorials tips tricks and hacks visit my website at www.wp-bff.com forward slash MailChimp that's where you can purchase my MailChimp's, MailChimp tips, tricks, and hacks video where I dive super deep into everything about MailChimp so that you can um, use it to find more people that, um, more of your ideal customer, how you can use it to automate all of your boring email tasks, and how it can just do so much to help you with your business. So that's www.wp dash bff.com forward slash MailChimp.